Good morning, Mrs. and Dreamers. Bob here. I know we all love chocolate. Well, most of us do anyway. You ever get a hunker for something really chocolatey, really sweet, something unique? Well, today we're going to make something unique. Today we're going to make chocolate stuffed French toast. Yep, I'll say it one more time. Chocolate stuffed French toast. This recipe came from one of my subscribers. Her name is Cooking with Kabar. I will put the link down below to her channel. She lives in Pakistan, but she cooks American like we do, and it's really kind of neat. So go check her channel out. So anyway, let's get started. I'll show you the ingredients, and I'll show you step by step. All right, what we're going to need is a big loaf of unsliced white bread. Some Hershey's chocolate, some Hershey's chocolate chips, eggs, Cool Whip, milk, powdered sugar, cherries, cinnamon, vanilla, chocolate syrup, a cup, that'll come into play, and a frying pan. So I'll show you how to do this and let's get started. Alright, this is our white bread. We are going to cut this into thick slices. And then I will show you, we need to take the crust off, and then we're going to stuff it with chocolate. Alright, there's the first one that's stuffed. You should be able to put about three pieces of chocolate in the first one. There's our round that we cut out with our cup. You should be able to fit two in here. Okay, four eggs, quarter cup of milk, one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Alright, that's what you should have after you take the crust off. So what we're going to do now is we're going to make a pocket in one of these, chocolate, and then we're going to make the round, hence the cup, and put chocolate in that one too. So, I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Alright, so that's what it should look like. Little pockets with chocolate in them. Now we're going to dip them in here. We're going to let them soak. We're going to take them out. We're going to do them like French toast. But the key piece, which I find a little easier doing this recipe, is we're going to finish these off in the oven. Non-stick pan spray and butter inside your nonstick pan. Alright, I'm going to soak the pieces in the egg mixture and then we're going to put them on our pan and we need to brown these on all sides. Alright guys, the easiest way to do this is to do the sides first and then the top and the bottom. This way you don't have burn marks or scorch marks. We're going to transfer it to a cast iron frying pan, put it in the oven, give it about three, four minutes, let it uh, finish off in there, and then we will plate this, and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, they are done. Now we're going to stick these in the oven again for about seven minutes max, about 350, and then I'll show you exactly how to plate this up. All right, whipped cream. Our chocolate chips, chocolate syrup, and one cherry on top. Now guys, if you want to, you can use powdered sugar before you put this on here. I think that's too much sugar as it is, so I don't use it. But anyway, there you go. All right, guys, there you go. There is your chocolate stuffed French toast with whipped cream, chocolate sauce, some chocolate chips, and a cherry. So if you're new here, please subscribe, hit the notification button, hit the like button, leave a comment because I love reading comments, and we'll see you in the next vlog. Have a great day, guys.